A program through the Spokane School District that helps students when most routes fail is now asking the community for help for one of the most basic needs, food. New on Nightside, Ronya Core explains. This isn't your typical pottery class. Just a few students of Spokane Virtual Learning are here at the Hive. Students are referred to us through Spokane School District who have experienced exclusionary discipline or have high levels of anxiety walking into the traditional school setting. They spend two days a week learning here and two days a week at the gym. The rest of the time, they're online. So they're still receiving credit through our school, which is Spokane Virtual Learning, and as a branch of Spokane Public Schools as an alternative learning experience option. It's a choice option within Spokane Public Schools. For Aaron Haddon's two boys, it was an uphill battle until they came to Spokane Virtual Learning. In ninth grade was the start of when they got suspended for 40 days, and we, I didn't think we were going to pull out of this, but we, 100% have. With spring break beginning next week, though, there's one thing that instructional coach Dr. Kristen Arnold is nervous about. There's a lot of uncertainty that they're facing um, in terms of food insecurity. A lot of students we have move between homes, and so with that comes a lot of anxiety about where their next meal might be coming from. Arnold is asking the community for help stocking a fuel pantry in their classroom with nutritional options. They're amazing students and they're very resilient and they deserve a high quality education and um, access to food security. In Spokane, Rania Kaur, 4 News Now. If you would like to help, the link to donate can be found on our website, kxly.com.